everyone, and welcome to Spooky Findings. I'm your host, Sonya. How do you do today? Or tonight, whenever you watch this. Yeah. So y'all clicked on here, seeing that it's from Walgreens, but before we get to that, I just wanted to mention if you're new here, my name is Sonya. This is S Family Studios. This is mostly me doing a shop with me, um, vlogging, taste tests, and sometimes I do things with my husband. So if you like what you see, please subscribe, like the video, and comment down below. Before we get into the video, I just wanted to mention for future videos for this Halloween spooky findings bit, um, I do want to do another like Halloween slash fall fashion thing because I have gotten a lot of clothes this year and I'll show them off. And I have kind of like a costume idea that I'm probably going to wear on Halloween. So stick around for that. Um, other ones will probably be, like I said, maybe like underrated or favorite Halloween-esque scary movies I like watching around this time of year. Without further ado, this is my little shop with me with Walgreens. And please stick to the end of it because there is some, something interesting that I'm sure a lot of you will actually like at the end. So here we go. Walgreens exclusive Frankenstein pop figure, Freddy, Beetlejuice, and Jack, more Jack. Every day is Halloween, damn right. More Nightmare for Christmas things. Sally, Jack, Sally, Squishmallow, and some socks. I think this is I'm the Pumpkin King or the Pumpkin King. Sally statue. Some plushies, Jack, the mayor, and some weird monster guy. Don't know, remember his name. <laughs> and these were men's and women's sleep pants. There's one that's just Jack. And the multicolored one was the women's, which is, I guess, more colors of Jack. <laughs> they had multiple snow globes that lit up. Just like a canvas art of Jack. Spooky. Countdown days to Halloween. Another snow globe, pumpkin lit up with zero. And I guess Jack's on the bottom with a tombstone. These pumpkins lit up. Jack and Sally in front of the moon. Jack and Sally on a pumpkin. Halloween bowl, Mickey Mouse bucket, Stitch bucket, Disney princesses, some of them anyway. Carbon gets, glow sticks, help the trick or treaters. And these bags were had like a see through thing so you can see them. There's a bad and candy. These I was trying to figure out how to turn on. More glow sticks, pumpkin lights. And these little guys you just squish. It looks like their brains are coming out. There's a bat. Kind of fun to squeeze. A little pumpkin puking out. There's a kitty cat. And some light up bracelets. There's a witch and a skull. This is a bat. I thought it was one of the squishy things, but it lights up. Kind of see it on the camera. These guys kind of do the same thing. You can squish them and it lights up. Little skeleton light. Pretty decent for little trick-or-treaters. I believe these are slimes. More light-up sticks. These are pretty cool. These ones were vials of slime. Well, test tubes, I guess, would be more accurate. <laughs> bouncy eyeballs there. I think these were bouncy too, spike balls. Uh, stretchy like snakes. 
squishy guys. It literally just says squishy characters. There's like more squishy guys and I think these were like finger puppets. Halloween game. Like ring toss. Squishy bat. And spider. Uh, some treat bags. Happy Halloween banner. And some cool light up cups. One with pumpkins and this one was with ghosts and I was trying to figure out how to turn it on. Pretty cool. Some sparkly tumblers. Skeleton and kitty cups for kids. And sugar skull glasses. Well, they're plastic, but you know. <laughs> and ghosts, pumpkin, and candy corn necklaces that light up. Some earrings. A headband that says boo with ghosts. A couple masks. More headbands. Some like a pumpkin wearing a hat. And like probably like a Day of Dead sugar skull headband. Unicorn. Witch. And these are kind of just like pet costumes if you want to be a cat, devil. Cool butterfly wings that light up. Having uh, some hard times doing it. Weird looking clown, but a, clearly the Joker mask. Old man. Like an it costume. Creepy clown again. Scream mask. Skeleton. Skull, I guess. <laughs> Pretty cool pumpkins. Lots of makeup. Gotta have the fangs. Another headband. I think that was like a hair clip you could put in. Some ponchos. They're all uh, the web one. That was apparently a lantern with all their faces. Well, two jack faces. Hanging skeleton dude. That lit up. There's no button for them. Spiders, pumpkin lanterns, lights, a witch that hangs up, a ghost, and opposable uh, Jack. He wasn't working. Some ghosts and some skeletons. A bag of skulls. And different skeletons. Looks like moths and like a gerbil. Blow up Sally. And some spider and pumpkin lights. I think those were supposed to be dog skeletons. Sparkly uh, centerpiece of witch in a cauldron. Some potion bottles. Cool little candy bowl. think that pumpkin cat lit up. It's just a bunch of Focus Pocus. Spells book. Another skull one. I think they- yeah, this one lights up. Some candles. Trick or treat pillow. The backside is pumpkins. Some cloth pumpkins. And ceramic ones. Candles. Little figurines. Bird. <laughs> More pumpkins. Happy Halloween cups. Some tumblers. And some scrubs and lotions that were pumpkin spice scent. Or fall scent. Fall night sky. This was like a kit. Hydration kit. Lotions and stuff. Good night, goon. You're my little pumpkin pie. It's a bitsy spider. It's pumpkin day mouse. How to catch a monster. And blippy. And here's some garlands. And more glow sticks. And this one was just like a plushy jelly bean and gummy thing. 
bag of bones. Hello all and welcome back. So I didn't really get a haul for this. The only thing I got was um, toothpaste for my son and it was just a little bottle of shower gel that was pumpkin spice smell. Nothing too big. But uh, I went to Aldi's because that's basically the my pick of the grocery store around where we are and I found something interesting. Some, some of you 90s babies might enjoy, but I think I need a special guest to help me out. So here we are. Well, hello everyone, and welcome my guest, Clown Man. I thought he'd be, he was my special guest last year and I thought we should bring him back. Now, the interesting thing I found at Aldi's, at, of all places, was Pokemon trading cards. It says, Trick or Trade Booster Bundle. Now, 90s kids and nerds are like, could you imagine getting this in your Trick or Treat bucket? Like, I saw this and I thought... This was the coolest thing I've ever seen. Like, like why wasn't this a thing back when it was, like, more popular? <laughs> um, so, there is 40 mini packs in here, and I think each pack has three cards in it. So, we're gonna open, I guess, three packs each, just to see what it is. But, again, this is, like, the coolest thing. Like, maybe if you, let's say kids got this in their trick-or-treat bucket and either found a friend that night or next day at school... This would be awesome. <laughs> so, let me get it away from the Yes, if you want to see, go to your local old Aldi's and see if there are. Because they're only $12.99, I think. Which isn't that bad for how many you get. Holy crap. <laughs> Here we are. Whole bunch. Here's the next one. Would you like to pick one, Kellen Man? Oh my god, I can't open it. So we have Dark Rai, Dark Ray. I don't know if this will show up. It is a foil. Uh, Spinarak. Oh, that's cool. Oh, it even has like the pumpkin Pikachu. That's that's cool. Because these could probably be collectible if they didn't make that much. I'm sorry if you can't hear them. And uh, Murkrow, the weird like bird thing. What'd you get, sir? Here, I'm back. Would be cool if they had like a piece of chocolate or gum in them. But oh well. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? Ooh, that's cool. Uh, gorgeous. Is that supposed to be like a pun? <laughs> Another Murkrow. I'm sorry if I'm butchering these names. And another Spinarak. How you doing? Ah! <laughs> they exploded. Hold on. All right. Ah, <laughs> uh, who do we got? Oh, Mewtwo. And he's a foil. Um. Oh, this one's cool. Duskull. Did you get one too? Yay. <laughs> oh, this little guy's cool. Uh, Phantom. Phantom. <laughs> Apparently you kind of want to. Traverant. <laughs> so that was our three packs. E Sorry, do you need to say something? Uh, 
Am I allowed to talk now? So, so that was our three packs each. Um, we have a bunch more, and my son's really excited to see them because he's into Pokemon. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this little thing. And oh, I forgot to mention, I do want, I do plan on doing one kind of shop with me vlog. Um, just one more, going to a mall and seeing some other stuff. But uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and see you next time on Spooky Findings. Bye.